Hey guys, happy Labor Day. I hope that you guys have some awesome plans for today and had a nice weekend. Um, I am off to Sundance, Utah tomorrow, and I am so excited. Uh, those of you that have been following me in Avon, uh, you've probably heard me talk about Brendan Burchard, and he is a motivational speaker, he is, he studies marketing and psychology, and I have just um, really clicked with him and his message and purpose. And so a couple of years ago, I started doing uh, his high performance coaching. So I have a, a certified, um, pretty much business coach that I talk to once a week or once every other week. And for the past two years, she's been helping me move forward in my life, in my business, um, and it's been really exciting. And uh, tomorrow, I'm going on a trip to actually meet Brendan Burchard and Dean Graziosi in person. I became a part of the mastermind group. So um, I'm just super excited about it and wanted to share that with you guys. Uh, if you are in business for yourself, um, you're an entrepreneur, I think one of the most important things that you need to do is always be outside of your comfort zone. Um, and so if things are feeling like a little too routine where you're never pushing yourself, maybe it's time to to give that extra push and commit to something big that you're kind of scared about. Uh, my mom is going to travel with me for the next few days. I've never been to Utah, so I'm really excited about that. Um, I love my Avon business. We have a team that sells over three million per year. Um, sometimes it helps to jump out and get a different perspective from other people. So I'm really looking forward to that. Um, hey, I see Patricia and Cora. Kathy, welcome you guys. Where are you joining from? Are you doing anything exciting this Labor Day? Hi, Miss Katie. <laughs> um, so anyhow, uh, Brendan Burchard, he went through um, a really bad car accident and almost died, which is uh, kind of, you know, one of the reasons why I feel like I relate to him because of the brain surgery. I really started looking at life differently and decided that I wanted to leave a bigger footprint. Hi, happy birthday, Sarah Robeson. <laughs> Do you like my total tone change there? Um, anyhow, I decided that I wanted to do something more for others and um, really just share my knowledge of marketing and business. Um, so this year I have been um, pushing myself personally and professionally to always keep um, going higher and uh, I know it sounds cliche but living your best life um, becoming the best version of yourself uh, so some things personally that I've done that I'm really excited about is later this month Rob and I are going to the Luke Bryan concert near Madison Wisconsin and it's actually his farm tour so we're gonna be on the farm yeehaw <laughs> <laughs> and I'm excited. Um, I don't think Rob's as big of a fan as I am, but I'm excited to go do that with him. Um, and then in November, this one's uh, this one took a big commitment. It was a, a little bit of outside of my comfort zone, but I bought tickets to Lady Gaga because it's uh, she's in Las Vegas. She has that residency. I doubt she'll extend it, so I really wanted to do it while she's there, and it's happening on my birthday, so um, I decided that I couldn't pass that up. Um, so really just trying to focus on having experiences and staying out of my comfort zone. I feel like the more 
routine we become, the more we get set in our ways, um, and we kind of lose that excitement, um, that spur of the moment that you used to do all the time when you were a younger teenager. Um, so I see you guys joining from Tennessee and Connecticut and um, went to work today. Well, I'm glad you're home now, hopefully. Uh, we're gonna grill out some burgers and corn on the cob. My mom will be here tonight and we'll leave tomorrow morning. Um, super excited about that and I have successfully procrastinated on shopping, or not shopping, packing. I haven't done that yet, so. <laughs> I'm such a goof. I always like leave things till the last minute and then I panic. I think it just helps me like get very focused and, and do it all in a short time. Um, the kids start school tomorrow, so I am excited for them. They are starting third and seventh grade and I, um, I'm sad that I'm not going to be here for their first day, but um, having the job that I do, I am lucky enough to be there for them almost every day. So I try to keep in perspective, like not being so hard on myself if I miss this or miss that, because it, um, we get to do so many amazing things with uh, the Avon business, working from home, um, being able to travel. I think Rob's um, <laughs> dust busting or something. He always makes funny noises when I'm doing my lives. Um, anyhow, I hope that uh, my Avon friends are doing well. I uh, got all my email set up to go out this week. I've been blogging, uh, the beauty of uh, building an online business, um, so many great products coming our way. So uh, stay tuned as I will continue to be doing new videos and taking pictures of all those amazing new products. Um, I'm trying to think what else. Um, just excited to, to go on this trip. Um, I, I'm a little bit nervous about it because I haven't had the time this summer to um, really dive into any of the material that I have access to for being a part of this big program. Um, but maybe that's how it's meant to be coming into this. Maybe it'll give me a refreshed excitement um, and I'll dive into that personal development training. It's so important to um, always be learning, always be pushing yourself, um, committing to things that are bigger than you. Um, reach out and, and figure out what your calling is and what difference you can make in the world. Um, I feel like when I go live and I'm like, just like honest like this, people always think like something is wrong, but I'm not. <laughs> Nothing's wrong. I just uh, get excited and I want to share my message. So um, as I've gotten more successful, there are positive things that have come with it and there's negative things that have come with it. Um, so I take it, uh, you know, day by day. If, oops. If I'm feeling like I want to share, I do. If I'm feeling a little more private, um, then I, I do it that way. So um, hopefully you guys have a fabulous Labor Day and I will be sure to share. Um, I had his little flyer. Hang on, I'll go grab it. Okay, so if you don't follow Brendan Burchard, I really recommend it. Um, we are going to Sundance, Utah in the mountains. And uh, I think it's like three days of the conference and then um, some free time to do dinner on your own. I don't know if I'm gonna zip line or do anything wild like that. Uh, but it looks like it's going to 
be beautiful. We're renting a car. Um, unfortunately, it's not during the Sundance Film Festival, but maybe we can find a museum or something. Um, if you guys have any recommendations for the area, Sundance, Utah, um, let me know in the comments. And I will definitely share all of the things I learn. And I'm going to come back with better, more exciting business strategy planning. And I plan to share that with my team. So um, have a happy Labor Day, guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye.